for the Jayhawks. Right now leading by one. Robinson all the way to the cup. Con with the tip, no good. Right with the putback. Out of bounds, and it'll be USC basketball, but the Jayhawks off to a good start. Mario Chalmers, Chalmers from Anchorage, Alaska, out of the gate quickly. Your selflessness paying off with the deuce. Back after this. The Barbados World Cup, Thursday at noon Eastern on ESPN. At Zero Price, successful investing is about balancing risk and reward intelligently. For each one, five, and 10 year period, over 70% of our mutual funds beat their Lipper average, finding the right opportunity. Low cost mutual funds from T. Rowe Price. Invest with confidence. Request a complete prospectus or profile with investment objectives, risks, fees, expenses, and other information to read and consider carefully before investing. Ode to the Subway Club. Roast beef, ham, turkey. A big meaty sub is plotting a course through hungry seas. And your appetite just showed up on sonar. Boom. Subway. Eat fresh. So intelligent, it knows precisely when to turn rear-wheel drive performance into all-wheel drive control. So intuitive, it's beyond machine. The all-new 306 horsepower G from Infinity. Whatever it is, you can get it on eBay. ESPN2's exclusive presentation of college basketball is brought to you by T. Rowe Price. Mutual funds, IRAs, college savings from T. Rowe Price. Invest with confidence. And Infinity, makers of the all-new 306 horsepower G. Design beyond machine. A look at the museum here at Allen Fieldhouse. It is a veritable who's who of college basketball. As Kansas, the home team, leading USC 7-6. And so far, Kansas off to a pretty good start after a slow beginning in the first couple of minutes. And, Fran, some of their inconsistencies may be a result of their youth. Some of it is youth, Mark. But remember, a lot of these guys played a lot as freshmen. This team now is searching for go-to scorers. They almost defer to each other too much. We know Rush can put the ball in the back. What's the ball pressure now? There's no pure point guard for the Trojans. See what USC can get done here. Jai setting a screen for Young. Nick Young gets double teamed. They're trying to take the ball out of his hands, and he forwards USC to call timeout. Pushing him all the way out to midcourt. Tim Floyd can try and draw one up when we come back. Stick around. It's the season to wow, and our pledge is to help you wow them with gifts like an Xbox 360. With a huge selection of high-def games for them and easy-to-use parental controls for you, Xbox 360 takes gaming to the next level. Wrap up the wow, only at Best Buy. Well, Kansas has been inconsistent at times, Fran, but you can't fault their effort, especially defensively. No, defensively, they have been outstanding all year, but watch this now. You come off that ball screen, Nick Young, He's going he's gonna to get trapped by Sasha Khan, and he's got to have this ability to beat the big guy. Now, you can't let that big guy slow you. You've got to get through him. No way he should be able to stay in front of him. They go inside to Gibson, and he has it knocked away by Julian Wright. Robinson back the other way. That's the fourth turnover already for USC. We haven't even played five minutes. Nice lob inside to Julian Wright from Chalmers. Boy, Chalmers quite the playmaker tonight as well. Mark, last year they tried to play him at the point guard spot. That's really not his best position, but all around, Chalmers might be their most consistent player early in the year. Looking inside for Chai, it's tipped out of bounds. USC basketball. 
Excellent job by Chalmers. Watch him get into the lane off the dribble. Here comes the help. And what looks like a Steve Nash runner is actually a lob for right. Stewart knocks down the two just inside the three-point line. Roderick Stewart, third leading scorer, averaging over 13 a game. One half of the twin combination on the court tonight. Here he is again on the move. And he throws it away, but it'll stay USC basketball. He comes in, Stewart does, extremely motivated. Wants to show his brother, his twin brother, on the bench for Kansas his stuff. Not that he hasn't already seen it. That's right. <laughs> Many times. They both agreed that if they guarded each other tonight for a long period of time, that they would both foul out. <laughs> Hackett throws it away, and it'll be Kansas basketball. Daniel Hackett, Mark, will do a very serviceable job this year at the point for Tim Floyd. He's basically holding the fort down until the reinforcements in those recruiting classes show up on campus. Rush from way downtown. That was halfway down and out. Rush still trying to find his. Recovering from a three-point performance, a season low against DePaul in that loss. Now, what does USC have to do to get Young off a little bit offensively, Frank? Well, the main thing is there's no point guard that can really set him up. It's got to be off set plays and screens. And they turn it over their fifth of the game. Well, folks, tomorrow night on ESPN, two games from the Jimmy B Classic. First at 7, Oklahoma State takes on Syracuse. And then at 9, Louisville takes on Chase Bunninger and number 15, Arizona. Jimmy V Classic presented by Siemens, available in high definition on ESPN HD. Some outstanding freshmen in the Pac-10 mark, including Chase Budinger of Arizona. That ball knocked out of bounds, and it'll be USC ball. Both teams are a little uh, arrhythmic offensively. Coach of the Chicago Bulls as well. Swinging around weak side. Here's Stewart. See the screens. There's Young springing loose and taking it to the there cup. It is. Oh, a traffic jam wakes up the night here in Kansas. Well, he got loose because of the double screen on the weak side, and that's the kind of separation Nick Young needs to get going. Collins into the ball game at point guard for Kansas. John Collins, uh, another one of those young players, a freshman. Dangerous three-point shooter as well. Boy, Pond really working hard to get open inside. Sealed his man, Jai, and received the pass, but there's a foul. Mark, we talked, we talked about Nick Young getting going by using screens. Now, he comes off the double. There's the separation. Where's Rush? He loses him, and that gives Young the space and the athletic ability to get to the rim. Rush is going to come in, out of the ball game. Along with Robinson, a couple subs in for Bill Selsko. Stewart amongst them. 13-16 to go in the first half. Kansas down by one. Which Kansas team are we going to get tonight? Here's Collins. Right now. And you see right now they're playing three red shirts in the lane. A shake by Collins, kicks it out to Stewart. That's the other twin. Khan really going after it aggressively, couldn't find the handle. Well, they face guarded Chalmers that, that time, and that's what the game plan is. Young might have gotten away with a push off. Jai didn't get away with the over the back foul on the offensive rebound attempt. Well, there's Andrew Stewart, dad in attendance, watching his twin sons, Roderick and Roderick. Talk about mixed emotions. <laughs> More than a little ambivalent tonight. These guys text message. They're on the same cell phone plan. So they text messages at each other about a thousand times a month, Mark. And talking to Roderick Stewart today, there are two more twins on the way. A couple of 13-year-old brothers. They don't even date without each other. <laughs> Someone ends up the third wheel once in a while. There's Sasha Khan inside, rolling, but he walked with it. Well, Remember, Sasha Khan was a starter last year. This year, coming off the bench, Frank. Coming off the knee injury, he's really just getting back into groove. Not 100% yet, a strained patella tendon. But what Tim Floyd is doing is he's making people who don't normally shoot the ball be open. Roderick had that one go halfway down and out. Being covered by his twin brother on that sequence. Interesting occurrence. 
Well, he as Lewis was trying to check in for USC and ended up, I think, tripping up Collins on the sideline with the ball. Here's he, a look. Well, you see Tim Floyd's trying to give Lewis some instructions, and down goes Collins. <laughs> but he, Tim Floyd looked down at Bill Self.